us continue to trust in the power of our mother's intercession. As we pray in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the communion of the Holy Spirit be with you. And with your spirit. In Luke chapter 2, verses 34 and 35, Simeon tells Mary, Behold, this child is set for the fall and rising of many in Israel, and for a sign that is spoken against, and a sword will pierce through your own soul also, that the thoughts of many hearts may be revealed. Let us open our hearts to our Blessed Mother, Knowing that through her intercession, God will do something beautiful in our lives. Let us pray. Dear Mother of Sorrows, how can I not turn to you, who from the beginning has journeyed with him who is the man of sorrows? The sword of sorrow which I carry in my own heart, I uncover to you and ask that you intercede most powerfully on my behalf. This not. It's too much to bear alone, dearest mother. And I cry out to you who knows my pain and the sorrow so well. You know rejection and are acquainted with grief. You carry me in my sorrow and affliction. I know that you will lead me, sweet queen, to the newness of life granted me by the passion, death and resurrection of your son Jesus. I know and I am confident that my sorrow will turn to joy if I leave this knot in your maternal care. Our Lady Undua of Knots, pray for us. Amen. Amen. to the aid of a child in need, mother whose hands never cease to serve your beloved children because they are moved by the divine love and immense mercy that exists in your heart, cast your compassionate eyes upon me and see the snail of knots that exists in my life. You know very well how desperate I am, my pain, and how I am bound by these knots. Mary, mother to whom God entrusted the undoing of the knots in the lives of his children, I entrust into your hands the ribbon of my life. No one, not even the evil one himself, can take it away from your precious care. In your hands there is no knot that cannot be undone. Powerful Mother, by your grace and intercessory power with your Son and my liberator Jesus Christ, take into your hands today this knot.
I beg you to undo it for the glory of God once for all. You are my hope. O oh, my lady, you are the only consolation God gives me, the fortification of my feeble strength, the enrichment of my institution, and with Christ, the freedom from my chains. Hear my plea. Keep me, guide me, protect me, O oh, safe refuge. Mary, undoer of knots, pray for us. Mary, undoer of knots, pray for us. Mary, undoer of knots, pray for us. She is mighty. Jesus Christ be with you that he may defend you, within you that he may sustain you, before you that he may lead you, behind you that he may protect you, above you that he may bless you, in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. God be with you as you go through this day. Amen.